paying tribute to a man who helped to develop the current Hardin-Simmons University campus by building a new designation on the campus. It's an outdoor meeting place for study and conversation named for Don Bridges, who built several of the larger structures on the 40 acres, including the reflecting pond at the entrance to campus. KTAB's Miriam Chamberlain was there for the opening ceremony. Hardin Simmons University leaders and staff are dedicating its new courtyard in honor of their late general contractor, Don Bridges. The beauty of this campus is Don Bridges. Student Government Association President Elizabeth Waters says they couldn't have given it a better name. Because he poured into us always and he did whatever he could do to help us and help the university. And Bridges' son Steve says after 54 years of watching his dad build the campus, this was a special tribute for his family. Come back and, and enjoy the university with uh, them dedicating a plaza in my dad's name for 34 years of service. It's, it's just a beautiful thing. Bridges built many buildings on the HSU campus, and Steve says it was a family affair. He had three sons, and we all worked here over the years. Um, we were mainly his wrecking crew. We would go in and, and tear things out so they could put things back. Steve says he's excited for the students to enjoy this new plaza. Building the plaza at this time is, is really appropriate in light of uh, the COVID. COVID pandemic that has come because it's going to help to keep people outside and safe. But he's not the only one who's excited. I'm super excited to watch students use them. Water says she's happy to finish her student service with this project. As I leave, um, because I know how many memories I've made in this library with my friends studying, um, and just to be able to do it outside makes it even more um, enjoyable to enjoy God's creation and the weather um, and to be able to have community with it um, inside and outside. In Abilene, what coverage you can count on. Miriam Chamberlain, KTAP News. So thank you, Miriam. HSU said the project is finished a year ahead wow. of schedule. So the courtyard is ready for students to use for final exam studying. Ooh, those are right around the corner. Final exam <laughs> studying. Don't miss those. Mm, no, not at all. <laughs>